Hey you guys, it's Ade Wale, <laughs> but just call me Ade. <laughs> Okay, you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm trying to figure out what I should call you guys because we just got to 130 subscribers. I know it's not much, but because y'all are so cool, y'all should have a name. So I think I'm gonna call you guys the crown holders because I day the crown, you know? <laughs> but, but today I have something really special for you guys and it is the Booty Blaster Part 2, okay? Basically, it's like a remix to the last booty blaster video that I did. What makes it really cool is that you really don't need any equipment to perform any of these little routines I'm gonna do, so you can do this at home. It's really easy breezy, very granola. It's a workout, because you're gonna feel it, but it's very like, it's not too intense, you get? So, um, everything that we're doing, if you feel like it's a little bit too easy for you, because I'm going to incorporate some weights and some resistance bands in mine. You don't necessarily need to do that, but if you want that extra push, you can do those as well. So, stay tuned. Bye! Alright, so we're going to start off with these today. And these are just regular lunges with a high knee. What this does is not only does it engage your glutes, but it also engages your core and your quads and your hamstrings, okay? You basically just want your knees shoulder width lengths apart um, and just try to keep your balance, okay? From here, we're gonna go directly to our staple exercise, okay? And that is, you guessed it, the squats. Um, basically, you'll notice that putting the weights in the front like that is gonna focus more your energy towards your quads. So basically, if you wanted it to be more so geared towards your glutes, you just set it on the back. And make sure to dip pretty low so it can go towards your glutes as well, okay? Now we're gonna go into our squats with our leg raises. So these are basically great for killing your love handles and making your gluteus and medius just a bit more engaged in the regular standard squat. So in essence, it's practically a waist snatcher on its own, okay, sis? <laughs> now let's literally jump right into our jumping squats, okay? This is practically just like regular squats, except for now it becomes cardio as well because we're jumping and we're utilizing our cardiovascular muscle. So you'll find that you'll probably be a little out of breath. And if you want this to really engage your glutes like heavily, you want to get low on your dips as well. So now we're going to do our self-regulated hip abductors. And I was utilizing this for balance, but you can also do this against the wall if you feel more comfortable that way, if your balance isn't up there. Um, this is going to engage your gluteus minimus as well as your gluteus medius and it's effective, okay? So by now you guys must know that I swear by these and these are the donkey kicks. These donkey kicks are going to help you pretty much sculpt your glutes. It's going to engage all three major parts of your glutes, which is your, your medius, your maximus, and your minimus. And it pretty much just helps you sculpt um, and it lifts your tush up just a little bit. <laughs> Let's get right into these mountain climbers. So these are basically going to engage several of your joints and it pretty much engages your abs for the most part. And then it's cardio, so it's a good thing. Sticking with our abs, we're gonna go ahead and do our leg raises. These mainly help you shape your lower abdomen. Also, if you raise your legs high enough, it can go up to your upper abdomen as well. Continuing right along with our abs, we're gonna go ahead and do some crunches, okay? Don't even know what these are called, but I'm just gonna call them toe touches, okay? Or ankle touches. And what this does is it aids in burning side fat. So your little love handle's gonna be gone after this. <laughs> Sticking to our core, we're gonna go ahead and do a plank. <laughs> Forgive my face, I think a song was playing and I was feeling it, so I guess I just had to say. Whatever. This is going to engage our core. It's pretty much your whole body, really. And it also 
fun fact, in Fusion Moves, which is why I'm like doing the planks. Supposedly, anyway. So these are obviously very granola, really easy to do. They're literally just step ups. And what it does is it engages your gluteus minimus muscles, which we never work on. And it helps your butt just get a little bit more full, okay? Don't remember what these are called either, but we're gonna go ahead and get to a uh, side plank stance and raise our legs. This will engage your gluteus medius, your gluteus maximus, and your core. Yeah, okay, I'm really dropping the ball, you guys. I don't know what this is called either, so we're just gonna go ahead and refer to them as the plank dips, okay? This engages your obliques and your upper thighs. And we're gonna finish off with our medicine ball and a good old wall. <laughs> we're gonna throw our medicine ball up about 10 to 15 feet, and we're gonna finish it off with a good old squat, dipping as low as possible to keep those glutes engaged, okay? And that is all. Okay, so the next time I say that we're gonna have ourselves a good little workout, you're gonna believe me, aren't you, sis? Okay, yeah, that was like a lot. And to be honest, I'm not really even tired. I could really go another hour, but it's 3 a.m. sis, and I have church in like four or five hours, five hours. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and cut this video maybe just a little bit short, but I'm pretty sure you guys can get a good ass workout in with this. So anything that you guys wanna see me do, anything else that you guys have for me, like, comment, and subscribe over here. And don't forget to hit that bell button. I realize I never, I never say that. <laughs> so you guys can be updated of all my new videos and who doesn't wanna be touched by that, right? Okay, crown holders, peace. <laughs>